What's up, you guys? Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights of Warriors Switched in Time, where we will be taking on Night 3 in this video in the study. So without further ado, we will take on Night 3 in the study and see what it has to offer for us. This actually looks more like a library than a study. I don't know why that is. <laughs> Here's the cameras. Hey, I see you found another room. Where is it exactly? The study. Not a bad choice. But is there a lamp there only lighting half of the room? Yeah, there is that a lamp. That might come in handy. You see, if the spirit tried to find you from the left side, you can just leave the lamp on, since the spirit is used to taking a darker route to get to you. And if the spirit were to appear to your right, you need to turn off the lamp. They won't be able to see you from there because they're used to taking a brighter route. And by the way, eye contact still applies, so look at the opposite side of the room when they enter. Oh yeah, if something appears in front of you, you can get rid of it by just pulling up your camera or turning off the light. That should be it. Stay safe. Good night. Okay, so whoever comes from the left side, which is the dark side, we have to look to the right. Whoever comes from the right side, from where the, the lamp is on, we have to turn it off, look to the left. And whoever comes from the middle, we have to put the camera up. Alright. And like I said, this study looks more like a library than a study. I mean, a study is usually just an office. Not a library. Okay, so I gotta check both sides for whoever's coming in the middle. Hmm. Oh, here's Yo oh, Yoshi. Look to the left side. Okay, so we're deal. So if Yoshi comes to the right side where the lamp is, then we have to turn it off and look to the left side. And Yoshi is purple and not green. That's actually really interesting. In fact, I don't know why the characters are like dressed in different outfits in this game. Cause I mean Yoshi's usually Yoshi's usually green unless if there's you can play as more than one Yoshi. Oh here's Wario. I forgot to point this out in the last video, but Wario is dressed in his motorcycle outfit in this game. And anyways, if Wario comes from the left side, we gotta look to the right. Okay, so we'll, and I don't know who's gonna come from the middle, but we'll find that out. That's oh. Yoshi's here, gotta look to the left direction and turn off the light. I have never heard those type of footsteps before. The ones I just heard, not the regular ones. I haven't seen anyone come from the middle yet, so that's good. And the only time I have to use the camera this night is if someone comes in the middle. Because then we have to put it up. Interesting. Hmm. Anyone coming? Let's see. Oh, there's Wario. Gotta look away from him. Did Wario leave? Yes, he did. Checking for Yoshi. I've already seen Wario, so that's good. Ah! Yoshi! Gotta look to the left. Okay, good. We got rid of Wario and Yoshi. And I haven't seen anyone come from the middle. Hmm. Like I was about to say, with with Wario, um, usually in 
these type of Final Fantasy Warriors games where you hide in a house, he oh, he has a skull for a head. But in this game, he doesn't. That's that's really interesting. Oh, that's Yoshi. Look away. And then Yoshi's usually green in most Final Fantasy Warriors games, and not purple like he is in this game. Okay. And so far, I have like, and so far, nobody's came from the middle yet. But I do have to deal with Wario right now. Hmm. Oh, Yoshi, look away. And I gotta turn the light off. Okay, I got rid of him, so that's good. And I don't know why nobody's came from the middle yet, but that's really interesting. There's Wario. Yeah. Hmm. All right, and we've beaten Night Three in the study. And I actually just remembered Mario, Mario, or. Dr. Mario, as he's called in this game, because he's wearing a doctor's suit, appears in the middle. And I know that because I tried, because I tried, did this video yesterday to see who came from the middle, and it was Dr. Mario. And I don't know why Mario's in a doctor's suit. And this is actually the first FNAF, I mean, Five Nights of Warriors game that I've seen Dr. Mario. Because usually in most of these games, I see Mario and he's headless, but in this game, he's not. Okay, so since I have enough time left to record, we will take on night four in the home theater because when I tried doing this video yesterday in the um, first bedroom and the second living room, those were tricky rooms to hide in and I kept getting killed. And in that same video yesterday, that's how I found out that Dr. Mario comes from the middle. He didn't, he didn't show up in the middle in this video. I don't know why, but that's really interesting. But anyways, without further ado, we will take on night four in this video in the home theater as well and see what has to offer for us. And I'm going to do the home theater since I do like going to the movies, so why not? Welcome to the home theater of this place. I bet you were expecting a phone call. <laughs> I can pop the nose. One. All the guidance you'll need for this night is the screen in front of you. Okay. Follow it for as long as possible to win and try not to lose. You'll not like what happens then. Okay, we got two Wario games on the wall, which I can honk the nose on the Wario world. Not on that one. Okay, so we have three lives right there. I'm assuming... I'm assuming that if we dial three times, then the game's over. Use the camera. Okay, we gotta use it for Wario. Don't look, okay? Turn away from Mario. Okay, so whoever appears on the screen, we have to follow the directions. Find me. Where's Peach? Aha! Found you, Peach. Okay. So I found Peach, and then we found, um... And then we had to put up the camera for Wario and look away for Mario. Who's next? Okay, Mario again. We gotta look away. Don't move. That's Yoshi. Use the camera. That's Wario. And we can't tell what time it is. I don't know why there's no timer on this for this movie theater, but that's interesting. Find me. Okay. Let's go look for Peach. Aha! Found you, Peach. Let's see who's next on the, t the movie theater screen. And I'm assuming we just rinse and repeat until we beat the night. Who's next? Don't look. Okay, look away from Mario. Alright. And we can look at the screen again. A really in This is actually a really interesting room. Oh, click me. Okay, click on Luigi. Keep moving. That's Bowser. Find me. Okay, we got Peach. 
Let's go look for Peach before she tries to kill me. Aha! Found you, Peach. There we go. Okay, so this is actually pretty easy. So far, we're doing good. Use the camera. Okay, Wario. Who's next? Don't move. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so this is actually a really interesting room to hide in. We just gotta follow the instructions, or else we die and then lose our lives. Camera down. That's Waluigi. I have it down already. Click me. Here's Luigi. Don't move. All right, we got rid of Yoshi. Perfect. The instructions are on the screen, like the phone guy said. Or announcer, as more to be referred. Keep moving. Okay, move for Bowser. As you wish, your majesty. <laughs> and I will find you as well, your, your highness. <laughs> Don't move. All right. Okay. Find me, okay. I found you, Peach. Click me, Luigi. Keep moving. Alright, as you wish, Bowser. I will follow your commands, whoever is on the screen. <laughs> Alright, this is actually this is actually the funnest this is actually the funnest room I've ever done in this game, the home theater. Run! Okay. How do we run? Okay, why is the screen going black? Oh, we beat... Oh, we beat Night 4 in the home theater. Okay. That's why I went black. Okay. I thought we were going to die, but I guess not. Okay, and since I have enough time to... Let's record, we'll take on Night 5 in this video as well. Okay, what's going on? We have some sort of cutscene for Night 5. Okay, who's that? Okay, I see Wario, Waluigi, Dr. Mario, and Luigi. Which Luigi's dressed like a thief, dressed as a thief. Wario and Waluigi are dressed in motorcycle outfits. Oh, there's Wario Man, a.k.a. Bruno Gates. After all these years, I finally found you. I came here to say that I'm sorry. The things I did, I remember it all. I paid the price for it. Will you all be able to forgive me? Oh, so this is the same cutscene as it is with Final Fantasy Warriors 3. Will they forgive him? Let's see. Thank you. I think they did forgive him. Oh, and Wario Man just died. Who killed him? Daisy? Why did Daisy kill him? <laughs> He's dead. Daisy's in this game too? I didn't know. The one who did it is dead. What? We we got our revenge. Okay, where are we for night five? We're in some sort of room and it's dark. Are we at the oh we're at the gates okay we're at the gates for night five okay uh hello are you still there Phew, that's good wait 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 slow down you're you're outside the house why the gate blocking the way oh no that's bad very bad it is bad Your spirits are probably still there probably way more aggressive than before man okay just listen closely what I guess you should do is for the spirits of the brothers. Avoid eye contact and look away. And for the other spirits, well, there's only one solution I can think of. If something appears behind the gate, quickly pull up your camera. If something besides the brothers appears on either side of the gate, tap the camera pad multiple times to make the shocking sound to scare them off. If something appears directly in front of you, though, shine your light on it to get rid of it. Remember, though, you can only see the spirits through the night vision camera only, so make good use of that. And make sure to listen for movements and be ready to react. Alright man, hang in there. I'll be on my way.
way to try and help you. See you when I get there. Okay, so for Mario and Luigi, we have to look away from them. Ah, dazing! How do I deal with dazing? Do I just shine my light at her? To get rid of her? Okay, that's how we get rid of Daisy. Okay. So for Daisy, we have to sh we have to shine we have to shine our light at her to get rid of her. Mario and Luigi, we have to look away from them. And then I don't know how we're gonna deal with the others. Okay. Waluigi. How do I deal with him? Do I just tap on the camera to get rid of him? Or do I just look away from him? How do I deal with Waluigi? Oh, it's Luigi. We gotta look away. Okay, so for Mario, Luigi, and Waluigi, we have to look... away from them. Great. Thanks a lot, Luigi. You just killed me. Oh, and it just brings me back to the menu after I die. Okay. Alright, so, night five, we're in the gates. I'm gonna listen to that phone call again, just so I can get a better understanding. For Waluigi, I know we gotta look away from him. I mean, Daisy, we gotta shine the light. We have a night vision just like we do in the cellar so we can see. Okay, so for, let me think. For Mario and Luigi, who are the brothers, we have to look away from them. And then for Waluigi, we have to tap the camera repeatedly. And then for Daisy, we have to shine the light at her. And then I don't know if we're going to deal with any of the other characters this night, or if it's just the four of them. Ah! Mario, we need to look away from him. Did Mario leave? Okay, good. Or, Dr. Mario. Okay, Dr. Mario left. Oh, he's back. I gotta put... I gotta look away from him. Okay, I saw Peach. I just got rid of her by tapping on the camera. Okay. So that's how we deal with Peach. Same technique as Waluigi. We just, same strategy as Waluigi. We have to tap on the camera. And then for Mario and Luigi, look away from them. Daisy, we shine the light at her. Alright. Peach has the same mechanic as Waluigi. We just have to tap on the camera. And the night vision's helpful, just like with the cellar, because it's dark. It's pretty dark outside. And I don't know who that thing is behind the bush, if I should be concerned about it or not. I mean, I've already died once in this video so far, which is to Luigi. Ah, Luigi, we need to look away from him. Oh, how, oh my god. Uh, how do I deal with Luigi?
Do I just, I think I have to look away from him on the camera. That's what I think I have to do. Okay, I figured it out. I think for Luigi, we have to look away from him on the camera. Mario, we have to put the camera down and look away. How do I deal with Luigi anyways? Do I just look away from him on the camera or do I just put it down? Because he said look away. The phone guy said look away from them. Okay, Mario comes from the middle of the camera, so we have to look away from him. Okay, there's Wario, so we need to tap on the camera to get rid of them. Him, so I'm assuming he has the same mechanic. Okay, so he has the same mechanic as Peach and Waluigi do. We just got to tap on the camera. And then Mario and Luigi both have the same mechanic where we have to look away from them. Okay, I figured out how to deal with Luigi now. Ah! Oh my god, I just saw Wario and I couldn't react in time because I was dealing with Luigi. Ah! Okay, I knew I was going to die to Wario because I couldn't react in time. Because I was busy trying to figure out how to deal with Luigi. Okay, so for Luigi, we have to look...